So, we're currently in the midst of a fourth industrial revolution. The first happened way back in 1760, where machinery began to do the jobs which were traditionally done by people in collaboration with animals. The means of production were changing. The second began with the advent of electricity. The efficiency of manufacturing increased, as did unemployment, which luckily was short-lived. The third was not so long ago and ushered in the age of computing. Suddenly machines could perform tasks that would take humans years to perfect. It also introduced us to the internet. And we all know what that brought us. You've got mail. And here we are in the fourth, a time of entirely new possibilities for people and machines. In the past industrial revolutions, machines have been replacing humans. But now we have the opportunity for machines and humans to collaborate and improve efficiency in the workplace. Concepts such as robotics, automation, and artificial intelligence seem like exciting, futuristic inventions. But they're with us now and are having very real impacts on our livelihoods. With the sudden appearance of COVID-19, an unprecedented 44 million Americans have filed for unemployment as of June 2020. Of those Americans still in work, 43% are employed in low-wage and part-time jobs, and 16% are employed in the gig economy. People of color are disproportionately affected, with a projected 12 million Black and Latinx workers expected to be displaced in the near future. The combination of COVID-19, racial inequalities, and long-standing automation trends all support the need for accessible reskilling. Lifting workers from jobs that are dangerous, low pay, and threatened by automation to growth opportunities in the heart of the emerging post-COVID economy. Like industrial revolutions before, new jobs and workplaces are going to be created. 46% of all tasks in the U.S. have the potential to be automated, opening up new opportunities for 54 million workers. We can transform our societies, cultures, and economies to ensure that all workers have a dignified pathway into purposeful employment. The future of work isn't robots, and it isn't drones, nor is it AI. The future of work is people.